Hey guys, welcome to day 4 of True Solo on Smalls. In this episode, we start out teming a griffin because it's much smaller and faster and really helps us stay stealthy while we scout the map. Griffins are also very flexible tames and allow for interesting combos due to the fact that you can use weapons and tools while mounted. They're also super, super easy to tame, and I should have done this earlier. And one last thing I want to bring up before I start the video is, if you guys enjoy the True Solo series, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share this with your friends. It really helps out, and it gives me the motivation to make more content. Now I'll just shut up and let you guys enjoy the video. Alright, so we're clubbing out this griffin here. Just clubbing him out with the fucking club. Well, obviously. I assure you, it definitely works. This is how I tame them a lot. I like doing it like this. Because they do take a lot of narcotics. And I don't like crafting narcotics, or crafting anything in general, so... This really helps with that. I really just did that. Kind of a goof. And it's out. Just like that, boys. That's how we club out a griffin. Pretty simple. Alright, boys. Griffin just tamed. Let's check its stats. Honestly, I have no idea what's good on griffins, but it just seems to be pretty good. Can't complain. Alright. Oh yeah, boys. Griffin feels a lot better than a fucking wyvern. Oh yeah, it's been a while. It's been a while, old friend. Just so you know, I used to be a fucking griffin god, but... I never used it, it's been a long time. But I'm glad to be back on a griffin. It's fun. That one's dead. in some stamina if you guys didn't know this you can actually get on the back of your griffin and get on a passenger seat even if you're in the air and you'll regen stamina it's pretty useful where'd he go where are you let's see He should go for his friend's PT. Actually, I don't know. No, I think I see him right there. That's a Giga, I think. Holy shit. Trying to shotgun me. Let's get out of render. Where's this guy? It's actually two of them. I thought we'd be able to kill this thing, but we aren't doing, any, doing enough damage. There, actually, there might even be three of them. That's way too risky. I'm not going back over there, unfortunately. Just gotta know when you can't make anything, you know, you can't. There's no kills to be had there. Way too dangerous. I just got knocked out, I think. If he died, I can't really tell. I don't know what just happened here.
I think this guy's gonna shit flack. I'm just gonna go for a dive on him. I'm just gonna swipe him. Oh my god, that was shit. Got him. Ooh, really good sickle. Some pretty shit flack. I think he knocked that dude out. Wait, what the fuck? The Giga's there now? Wait, how'd the Giga get there? How the fuck did the Giga get there? This man's legitimately half fucking naked. Why is he half naked at the op? With a giga. Bro, if I be cryos. Put a raid up here in the waterfall. He has heavies in his little base, but there is an exposed cable and he was online last time I was here so I gotta be careful yeah he's still online he's sleeping in the bed so he's AFK so I think this would be kind of funny if I just raided him yeah there's the exposed cable so see if we can hit that I made some flame arrows here and I got a decent crossbow so we should be able to Hey, there we go. Okay, I was about to think we weren't going to get it for a sec. I was like, damn, do I really got to stop this recording? Pretend I hit all my shots? This should be all off, right? Just fly over for a second. Yeah, we're all good. Hey there, how's it going? And Narknades? Jesus Christ. Craft a C4, sure. Where are his tames? Okay, but at least we can make some more grapples. Let me forget, let me not forget to uh, kill him. There you go, there you go. Just found this base. There's a fucking blood stock right there. It's like 300. Holy shit. Yeah, I gotta get away from that. But I kind of want to see what it's about, you know? I kind of want to see what that stalker is doing. I'm about to delete this guy's furnace. Why did I destroy his refining forge? I don't know. You know, looking back on it now, I'm starting to think there's something wrong with me. This wyvern just came across us. It's gonna get us water buff. Did he not see us? Is he blind? What level is that? Well, it's actually high level. We gotta get stammed first before we fight this dude. He's just, I, like, I don't know what the fuck he's doing. There he is. What is he doing? I wish I could see him right now. Hello. 
Holy shit, he fucking talked. It scared the shit out of me. Hi. Where is he? Hi. How's it going? There we go. I didn't mean to pick. I accidentally right clicked. Oh, here's his friend is. Excuse me? Holy shit, why was it so fat? Got the fucking lance, but I'm going in, dude. Uh, I I seriously don't know what came over me here, you know? I uh, just kind of wanted a, a kill with the lance. I thought it'd be a funny clip, but you know what? I'm thinking about it. I'm a I'm actually a cyber bully. You motherfucker. He could turn and pick me pretty easily, so I gotta stop. I don't. I can't be retarded. This is man. Got him. We had him for a sec. Oh, we got him. And I'm doing it again, dude. The same dude. I'm about to do it again. A cyber bully him. You know what? It's, it's pretty mean, but in reality, I don't. I don't think most people would be able to resist the urge. I mean, if you had a lance and you were in this situation, would you do it too? <laughs> oh, that, dude, that's so mean. I, sh I I can't keep doing that. That's that's like really mean. What did I do down here? Got him. I got some oil. The guy asked me if I had any oil, so Merry fucking Christmas, I guess. <laughs> this guy just pulled a mana out at me on the AWB. Don't think he sees me, though. Oh, it was very weird. This naked dude just spawned in, ran up to the fucking AWB, and just pulled out a fucking mana. And just went to town. Fucking just actually scared the shit out of me. I didn't see him coming. You just don't expect that type of shit, you know? Here's a little tip on tracking players. So I'm going to go into a little bit about how I found this guy and how I tracked him down. So he pulls out his mana at Blue Ob. And we know this guy, we established that this guy's not very smart off of that. If, you, if you're, if you're going to pull out a mana out of Blue Ob when you're naked, you're not the smartest person in the world. So we know that... Uploading at an obelisk is not, you know, outside of his comfort zone. He's probably going to upload at an obelisk. The next closest obelisk would be green obelisk. So I guarantee you he's going to green because he's not going to upload at blue. He just pulled it out at blue. It would be stupid. It would be like really stupid to from the do that. So we know that he's going to be at green. Even if he decides to go there, I don't think he's going to be. Yeah, he's right here. As I predicted. 
I'm going to actually set a timer for 10 minutes. Nine minutes. Not 90 minutes. Nine minutes. I'm just going to chill up here. Do with the manager's crowd. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that's him. He's holding the cryopod. Gotta make this count. Can I please dive? Got it! Get me the fuck out of here, dude. Get me out of here! Go! Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. You want some cryopods? Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, tell your friends about the channel, and I'll see you guys on day 5.